friends, it is Miss Fushi, and welcome back to Life is Strange. In the last episode, we were um, trying to get information about Nathan leaving the school. We're on campus again. The end of the world party is very, very soon, and we're supposed to go and meet up with Chloe. And while preparing to start recording this episode, I noticed this rock formation over here when I did my test walk, and we can take a photo of it. So I'm going to take a photo of some rocks. One photo for posterity. And there we go. So that's what I wanted to do. Do do do. And now we can go and talk to Chloe. Justin, it's been so long since I've seen you. Because you're way too cool for us now, Chloe. There we Coast go. is clear. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can so have too. Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ah, oh, you suck. <laughs> Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. Let's do this. Adjusting myself in my seat. I washed my hair this morning. That was fun. <laughs> it's so lame, they don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Okay. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. Okay. The Vortex Club sucks ass. Love, Evan. Evan. Of course. That's why no shits were given. Evan rolls. Yeah, he does. <laughs> And after what happened to Keith, I feel so bad for her and her family. That's why you're so hot. <laughs> because you care. I'm really right. Who's talking about that? Toilet paper. Are toilet paper wars mandatory in the dorms? I guess so. Are there footprints out there? Every oh, that I did not expect. should have one blurry Bigfoot shot. Cool. I did not expect that. Footprints in the dorm. Let's see. Oh, I got an achievement on Steam for that. Sit and shit, free, free, free glory hole. That looks great. Let's see, can I has art? Some drawings here. Oh, jerks. At least nobody messed with the Kate portrait. Yeah, that's so rude. People are assholes. Let's see. Bigfoot got balls. The Prescotts roll this town. This can only be Nathan's room. It probably is. Yep, now it'll give us the option to go in. That's clever. Sorry, Kate. Looks like one of the jocks did care about Kate. That's so sad. Let's see. What's this? Poor Warren. This is the work of Nathan. He's so lucky I'm a pacifist. I wouldn't be. What does his say? Hello, Warren's room. Hawking and him make a good team. There's no unique picture of reality. And then this would be the exit. You guys ready to go in Nathan's room? Let's go. Shh. Oh, that works. Good thinking, Max. Whoa. Now I need to find Here. Nathan's phone. Or anything with clues. Let's see. Max, it's from uh, Chloe's mom. Max, now that David is not here, I need Chloe to step up and stop acting out so much. But that won't happen if you and her are getting mixed up in illegal crap like breaking into Blackwell at night. I know what happened, so don't bother to defend or explain. I hoped she would get her back on the right track, but it looks like she's getting stuck again. You could be such a good influence on her, unless you both want to play bad. But she can't keep blaming David now. I'm sorry, Joyce. Even I get into shenanigans, but I'm trying to be a good influence on Chloe. I know, Max, but... I forget, you're still teenage adults. Okay. And one from our dad? Oh, okay, saying it's been a tough week. Okay. 
Let's see, we're gonna snoop. That's so cute and ironic. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. Nathan Prescott, the best son in the world. Maybe he's got some sort of mental disability and that's why he's so mean. That monochrome camera is brand new and cost about six grand. Bastard. Yeah. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, the Prescott's rule. Oh. I don't think this prescription has helped, Nathan. No. I wonder what movie he's playing. It's playing over and over again. Let's see, a photo? I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Oh, poor baby. What's on this? Let's computer? see what Nathan hides in here. Yeah, let's look. Nathan is way into this party. So Nathan Bad Prescott sign. to Victoria Chase. Hey, gorgeous. Let me know what you're wearing to the Vortex this week so I can pick to wear something as stylish and expensive. I'm psyched about going and I'm picking up some serious party favors. I even told my dad to keep the pigs away from Blackwell so I can get wrecked without hassle. If, you're go if we're going to have an end of the world theme, then let's do it effing on point, right? Bastard. Now I remember why I hate you. And why Kate will get justice. He's got that video up. Oh man. Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. So this is from Sean Prescott, who is uh, Nathan's father. Nate, I know this has been a stressful week, and your mother and I are here to talk if you, if need be. Just make an appointment any time. Your mother wants Dr. Bill to come out after his book tour, but for now, let's stick to your prescriptions. I need you calm and quiet while Pan Estates is being developed. I know being a Prescott is a burden, and I'll guide you into this room step by step as my father did. It was hard for me when my dad opened my eyes to our destiny, but you'll thank me someday. Don't worry about Blackwell. The shithole town is going to get an enema along with a fresh brand. I want you to be ready to take over when the moment is right. Don't fuck it up, son. Your father. That's awful. Anything Too bad else? Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome. And far away. And this is from Nathan's sister. Tudo Bem from Berlin, little brother. It's been too long since I've heard from you, so please let me know what's going on in your exciting scholastic life at Blackwell. I bragged to all my co-workers in the Peace Corps that my talented bro Nate got a full scholarship to one of the best art schools in the world. Even though I can't always check my mail or phone, please, please, please send me some new photos of campus so I can live vicariously through your lens. I miss you and your pictures. And yes, mom told me you've been in trouble and father has been on your ass, but you have to either ignore him or stand up to him. You know I love dad, Nate, but I'm also in a jungle halfway across the world because of him. He's a bully who inherited power, not wisdom, and the only way to win against one is to fight back. Don't let him change you into one just for the family legacy. End of lecture. You're at school, so I just wanted to make you feel at home. Back to the mangrove, sending out good thoughts. Better write back or I'll have a jaguar shipped to your door. XOXOXO, Chris. Christine. Yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. This is strong stuff. Ooh, that's not good. Extreme diet suppressant. Why? He doesn't need to lose weight. Wow. <laughs> Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. And this one's from the principal. Nathan, I'd like to apologize for the recent accusation. Your name and record speaks for itself. Sometimes students will use that to make their own name at Blackwell. I know your father was upset while I have assured him that you will never bring a weapon to school. I don't want you distracted from school and I'm certain this matter will be settled by the end of the week. If you have any questions, you know I'm always available to talk. Dang. All right guys, so we read through all those dang emails. Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A gift from... Ugh. He's even got the paper. What are these posters? Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. What kind of movies? These films all have a dark pattern. It seems like he's got some sort of issue. A mental illness. Nathan took this from Kate's altar. Why? What is with this dude? Maybe he needs help. Oh man. That dickhead stole one of my selfies. Can we take it back? No. Then he'd know. Scratch marks? What? What the hell are all those marks on the floor? That doesn't make any sense. 
Can we move Let's it? find out what you're hiding. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. What is that that we found? Now I have Nathan's phone, so I can show it to Chloe. Well, before Nathan comes back. Yeah, hopefully he doesn't. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. If only all your energy went into photography. It's so damn creepy, but the guy has his own style. Yeah, everything's skewed to the right in his photographs. I don't think one book can guide the Prescotts. I don't think so either. That must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. Let's see. That looks like a totally fun show. Even Nathan has a light side. Yeah, but some creepy pictures on his wall. What are those? Looks like someone's getting beat. Someone's wearing goggles and someone's wearing like BDSM strap gear or something like that. Why would I turn on some music? Whale songs? Maybe this is the only soothing thing Nathan ever hears. That's weird. I thought it would play out loud for a second, but then I thought it might be something important, so... That is so Chloe. Hey, asshole, we need to talk, or I'm gonna tell everybody what you did, and you're going to pay, Mother Effort. Oh my god. Chloe. Chloe. Oh, Chloe. That's when he took a picture of her. I wonder if we should have taken that, but we can't. I really hope they were all consenting models. Yeah, that's so weird. Let's see. Okay. I think we've looked at everything. I want to be really thorough for you guys. Like, I don't want to miss anything if I can help it. Yeah, I think we got everything. Nothing else glowing. Alright. Chloe! Chloe, I got the stuff. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So, what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Was that even Nathan's phone? Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. What are you doing in my dorm? Oh, no. You're such a nosy bitch, Max! Stop right there, Nathan! Make me, ho! <clears throat> Max! I got this! His shirt's awesome! Get the fuck out of my face! Oh, God. <clears throat> oh! Warren! <gasps> Warren! You are so fucking dead! Yeah. Uh. Get off me, no, bro! No, no, oh. no, no! <sighs> Okay. Stay out of it or stop Warren. Warren's beating the shit out of him. I think Warren deserves to continue beating the shit out of him. But hopefully nobody gets shot. Let's let Warren keep beating the shit out of him. You like to hurt people, huh? Like Max? Like Kate? Like me? Huh? Feel this, motherfucker! Damn, Warren. Damn, Warren. Don't kill him, Warren. Yeah. Don't kill him! Don't kill Please. him, Warren! <laughs> Please stop! He's down! Hey, come on! Stop! Damn, he really did not burn his face. Yes, we have to go! Who's the bitch now? Chloe! Uh, uh. Damn, Warren went full alpha on Nathan. And it was good. But scary. It was. That was pretty dang Shit, violent. Man. This really hurts. Well, th what do you think, dude? Carrying around a gun? A gun? Dumbass. Okay. I don't like violence in any sense of the word, but... There was a gun involved, and the choice that we chose ended up with nobody getting shot. So... I'm gonna stick with that. I think my face is broken.
No, your brain's broken, Nathan. I don't know. <laughs> but it was carrying around a gun, and that's not Damn. cool, so... That was intense. Warren, are you okay? Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? For beating the shit out of Nathan Prescott? Dude, you rule. I don't know. I kind of went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. It's okay. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. <laughs> or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh... So, maybe you better, um... Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes, you are. Ah, Warren. Look at him walk away. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. I know. He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not mm. keep him waiting. Let's get this done. Gosh, I hope I made the right decision. I just, I don't know. I feel like if we stopped him, maybe he would have turned and grabbed the gun and shot somebody, and I don't want anybody to die. So I'd rather a jerk get punched in the face a bunch of times than somebody die. But Warren beat the hell out of him. Did you, I did not expect Warren to do that. But I guess it shows he's willing to fight for people he cares about. Damn. I wonder if Nathan's still gonna go to the party. Or if he's gonna be wimpy and hide, or go to the party God. all crazy. I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole's gonna help us find Rachel. Or what? You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might even save you someday. About time. I am so going to hit you. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. Yeah. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just talk to Frank so we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Somebody's gonna get shot. Somebody is gonna get shot. Why else is a gun being brought if somebody wasn't gonna get shot? <sighs> I don't want to make the wrong decision. Let's go. Ooh, a flyer. A flyer here. What is this? There might not be any pan estates by Saturday. No, because we're all going to be dead. Let me look at the photos. A whale tail. We've been doing pretty good. We missed the first one, but we were doing pretty good. I've been trying to do as much as I can because I've actually been getting, like, steam cards and stuff like that and combining them to make badges. I learned about that recently. Let's see, there's a whale fin. It blows my mind that I was just here with Chloe in an alternate reality. There we go. Sweet. Not really sweet, because that's terribly sad. Max really makes me want to get a Polaroid camera. I think I will. I'd like to. Can't see inside with this shit blocking the view. No, we can't. What's in here? Take the trash out sometime, dude. Nah, just leave it on the beach. Dog bowl. Oh, fresh meat. So Pompidou must be okay. Good doggy. Yeah, Pompidou's okay. 
This is where Frank ponders his existence and gets drunk. I did find out from some people that we could have hurt Pompidou if we had wanted to when we went in his uh, trailer the last time. Behold, Frank's beer garden. I'm glad we didn't hurt Pompidou, but I'm wondering if that's going to screw us over because he's going to attack us. Or something like that. Frank doesn't need tinted windows when they're this dirty. It is pretty nasty. Alright guys, you ready to go inside? I keep getting off center here in my face cam. Sorry about that. Alright. Uh, please don't kill us, Frank! Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, or bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? I... I don't have the money. Yet. Oh, really? Then why did you text me that you did? Because I wanted to tell you in person. Oh, I'm truly touched, Chloe. Now why are you losers really here? We just want to ask you some questions. You have some serious lady balls. <laughs> no. Hey! His Jesus, tattoo is okay. stupid. Okay. But I'm not getting you high. Frank, we're not here to get high. No, you don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you hardy boys want? Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? Hmm. So you already did. That sounds dumb. You don't get it. Help her else, or I'm sorry. If we say you don't get it, isn't he gonna get mad? If we say I'm sorry... I don't know which one to choose. Let me go with... That's gonna piss him off. But this sounds so wimpy. Ah, don't do that. You don't get it, man. This is for a good cause. No, man. I do not get it. Especially from a weirdo like you. You know, I hate the way you talk to me like you... Like you know more than I do. No, no, I'm not. I... I... Oh, Christ, I hate you, Blackwell. Shits. You expect everything for free. You're not getting any handouts from me. I work for a living, you understand? Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. You snobby whores. Don't come into my home and judge me. That's why I go to church. And you what? want something from me? How about a blade up the ass, huh? Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch? Get it? No. Set the fuck back now! <laughs> Pompadou! Oh! Uh... You fucking killed my dog! No, 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 no. Damn. Damn, Chloe. Damn. Was there another way that could have been done? I didn't see one. Are you okay, Chloe? Oh, no! Chloe. I just shot a man. And his dog. I killed Frank Powers. You saved my life, Chloe. It, it, it was self-defense for both of us. Max? Frank is really dead. I know. But we can't stop now. We have to find that code. Fast. Before the co cops come. Oh man, guys, we killed Frank. Are we gonna go back, or are we just gonna... Is he just dead based on that we had That's a gun? It. Let's get out of here. Sorry, Frank. I'm sorry. Couldn't we go back and then her still have the code? Jesus. Chloe actually killed Frank. She'll never forgive herself. Or forget this. And... Only I can change it. Should we? Can we? Oh shit, we can. I don't know if we'd be able to. But what could we do differently so that she doesn't kill Frank? 
Frank, uh, your dog is kind of scary. Could you please close the RV door? You aim your gun at me, but you're scared of my dog? That figures. Maybe this will help. So he locks doors. Okay, there, you're safe. Now what do you want? Just the names of... Okay. Oh. Help her else, maybe? Now can we threaten him since we have the gun? Help us. Or else. Are you actually threatening me again, little girl? No, no, I'm not. I... Christ, I hate you, Black. Yes, Frank, without those Black... Frank, let's just Don't talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch! Get it! Step the fuck back now! Oh my god! Oh! God! You actually shot me! I wasn't gonna hurt you! He's not oh, dead. This fucking hurts! Oh, it hurts! Chloe! <laughs> you shot him! I know. You're both fucking crazy! What do you want? We... We just want the code for your account book. Now! You're fine! Whatever! Just... Just put the goddamn gun down! You already shot me, alright? There. Now leave me alone, alright? Just... Just get out of my life! Do you want us to call an ambulance, or...? No, thanks. You know what? I'll manage somehow without the police. <laughs> oh, right. Let's bounce. At least he's not dead. Oh, Damn, Frank! Ow! That looks like it hurt. I've never been shot in the leg. Shit. This could have gone way worse, but... Frank might be more dangerous to Chloe now. I know, but her oh, mental yes, psyche... Yes, you can change all this if you want. Okay, guys. Well, tell you what, I'm gonna go ahead and stop this episode here. Um, I know it sucks that we still shot Frank, but I didn't really want him dead. I feel like the look on Chloe's face, I don't think emotionally she could really handle that. And I need her head to be in the game right now as much as ours is. So, yeah, hopefully I made the right decision. But we'll find out. I just like wounding people, punching them in the face, shooting them in the leg, but not killing them. That's the way I play, apparently. <laughs> but if you guys are enjoying this series, please leave a thumbs up down below. Leave a comment, join in the discussion, and subscribe for more. And I will see you on the next episode of Life is Strange. Bye-bye. <laughs>